Hey, they're all craft beer lovers. Time for another beer review. We have a very quirky little beer on our hands tonight, guys. We are going to Sweden for this little quirky can. Going to Pang Pang Brewery out of the Stockholm region. Taking a look at their Pettersson Porter. Uh, coming in at a lovely 12% ABV. Where does it say? Well, I know it's 12%. And there we go. Maybe there. I don't know. It says uh, Pettersson Porter 2020 edition. Yeah, there we go. 12% ABV says it there. 25 mil can containing uh, barley malt, wheat malt and oats. And that's it. Very, very quirky little beer, I have to say. Look at that little chubby little can. Really, really quirky. 20, 25 uh, centiliters or 250 milliliters, 12 percenter, 2020 edition of Peterson Porter. Let's give it a bash, see what we get. So this is supposed to be a creme de la creme beer. I better hope so, because I paid a lot of money for it. There we go. Actually paid like... Almost like a hundred Swedish crowns for this one. That's almost like 10 quids for a 25 centiliter beer. There we go. So it's better be good. But then again, it's Pang Pang Brewery. And I really dig those guys. They tend to do a lot of beers. Good beers. Okay. Pink is worth of a nice uh, kind of brown... Colored head, mocha colored, small bubbles on top there. Uh, yeah, definitely jet black bear all day long on that glass, as you can see. There you go. Look at that. Well, it looks the part anyway. It looks like a very, very good porter. Let's get the aroma now. Okay. Uh, on the nose, raisins. Raisins, dark roasted malt, uh, like dates, figs, prunes, a lot of dark fruits, raisins and dark fruits, the dark roasted malt, bit of coffee, a little bit of a smoky vibe to it, almost like a bacon -y smell. Smoky bacony and a lot of dark roasted uh, malts and dark fruits. Let's give it a spin, see what we get then. Cheers, everybody. Mm. Oh, 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 my goodness me, that's a strong beer. Oh. Oh my, my goodness me. Oh, that's a strong bear. Okay, so where to begin? Uh, this beer is definitely, in spite of its small size, this is a mouthful. This is a mouthful. Let's go for another one. Mm. Oh. Ho, 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 ho. Okay, so let's stop kidding around here. This beer is in a league of its own, basically. It's, an, it's a league of its own. Uh, rich and gloopy. Full on dates, figs and raisins. Lot of, lot of dark roasted malt. Lot of dark fruits. And definitely raisins going on in there in abundance. Definitely dates. Figs, sweet figs. Chocolate, definitely. Coffee, licorice, and a kind of a heavy vinous, red vinous touch to it. Uh, it's definitely in a league of its own. A league of its own, guys. I'm sorry if I'm kind of a bit going on and on and on like a broken record, but that's how it is. Let's go for the final sip. Yeah, 
Oh. Definitely a boozy hint to it, but I mean 12%, so it's a 12% porter, so you definitely notice the alcohol. Uh, it's almost like a, like a marzipan touch to it. Very, very weird, but good drinking beer. But it's definitely not for the faint of heart. It's definitely a big, bold beer. Big and bold in spite of that small can, guys. Pettersson Porter 2020 edition from Pang Pang Brewery. Uh, for me, it's one heck of a porter. Uh, let me tell you that. Full on uh, dark roasted malts. A lot of dark fruits, vinous, licorice, coffee, figs, dates, prunes, raisins, a lot of that. Definitely a beer in a league of its own. For me, four out of five. Uh, very peculiar, but very, very well made. That was everything I had for today. Thank you very much for watching.